Hello people, welcome to the second match. Uh, here we got pretty much all that we need. We got our second drop, we play second, so we're gonna keep this hand. This will drop against planes, fair enough. Yes, hopefully get like another two or throw back a three drop. No, not quite. So we'll have to make sure with the uh, chain walk for now, which is fine. So we get a hell seed here already, so should be a nice boon. That's more land. Okay, well that's us attack first then. Pretty much all land we need. Uh, except for green lands, but I'd rather, rather have like some more playables on the field than uh, anything else this stage. Oh, our, our opponent's mana screwed. How delightful. Still though, there's nothing I can really do here as it stands. It's like, like two more turns before we get the hell seed in. Um, but yeah, there's nothing for us at the moment. Well, our opponent is unlucky, it seems. They're quite like an expensive deck, which is good for us. Tokens, eh? Okay. Well, one more turn till Hellseed comes out. Um, I'm quite happy he's got quite like a slow deck, because we are slow rolling as well at the moment. It's a bit of a shame. Oh, I guess you land out. What is it? Two, five, okay. Fair enough. Uh, we can still get a health seed out and get in for some serious damage. And that's what I want to do. Of course, I go six, five. And his armory guard is simply no match for the mighty health seed. Yes. Let's get in there. not blocking. Oh, brave man. So yeah, he's that next turn. So that's the first match. Because we can use a Trace Instinct, get like his guard. Or we can just use Chorus of Mice, one of our one of the creatures, and that should be the end of that. No, we're lagging for some reason. Okay here we go. Yeah that's it. So Trace Instinct on you And that should be game, I feel. Uh, so if we can play here, so there's no need to do anything else. So I can really think of anything you might have to stop this onslaught. Uh, two birds. That's the trick, I suppose. So it goes down to two life. Fair enough. Um, yeah, let's get this in. There's no need for us to, um, to show the cause of might. Okay, get this griffin in. Yeah, so just like get in there with the uh, cause of might, that will seal the deal. Uh, see, it does it. Yeah, it does. So yeah, let's get the cross of might on him. And that's game. Okay, I'm actually quite happy we got the uh, cross of might in our, uh, in our deck. Definitely making a difference for us. Okay, so we've got the guild mage to lead. And we've got Rakdos in our deck as well. I um, kind of wish I had like more cheaper creatures, but as it stands, we do have like um, we got something to play. 
We do have uh, Rakdos pretty much on the map, we need to actually get him into the game. So I'm feeling pretty good about this. Let's see, and Shambler as well. Okay, so like a 3 drop. 2, so... Hopefully we'll be like, quick out of the gates. As is he, fair enough. So, Chainwalker or Guildmage? I'd rather go with Chainwalker here. Just try to get, be more aggressive and don't want to get the move Guildmage to, uh, to die this soon. It's more value later in the game. We can actually do some board control. Um, and, like, you know, make him not block our creatures. Or if he does, make his creatures die for us. Okay, so it's going for like a populate kind of deck. Fair enough. Uh, questions, do we attack? Or do we not attack? If we attack, he can get his uh, Scourge Beetle in our way. Kill us. And then he's got like Scavenge for... I don't know, 100 turns on road, so I think we're not going to attack. Um, so then the question is, Guild Mage or Shambler? I think I prefer have the guild mage here, so next time we attack we can actually threaten to kill his creatures while saving ours. Let's hopefully get a land turn off the disc, that would be amazing. But let's see what happens. We take the shambler for like uh for play otherwise. Um so if the port stays the same, we're going to attack with the three two and then the only way you can kill us is by blocking with the Cellar of the Songbird and Drudge Beetle. That should be us. But yeah, a mountain this turn would be amazing to have. Nope, didn't get there. Okay. So... I can attack with him. He has to block with two of them. Yeah, let's attack. Need to be aggressive here. Because after this guy gets loose, or already is, but only got like one more birds to uh, populate as it stands. Block or not to block? That's the question. So, yeah, he's, he stands to lose two creatures if he decides to block. No blocks, okay. Takes damage, and we get our Shambler in. Yes, yeah, so we need our we need our red land sooner than later. Okay, he's going to one on flying creature. That's fine. We can deal with one on flyers. Yeah, so next turn, I'm going to attack with the uh, Sears Shambler. Hopefully get to draw land. Perfect. Okay, so we can attack with the uh, Shambler and the Gore House. And if he decides to attack, we can um, use his ability to kill whoever's blocking and retain our creatures. If he doesn't block, Rakdos is going to make our day here. So that's the play. See you attack with him as well. No, probably not. So let's see what he does. Yeah, so hopefully you get one of our creatures through, that would be amazing. If not, we can pretty much kill two of his guys this turn, unless he's got some combat tricks of sorts. But by the way, hopefully get Rakdos in here, that'd be nice. And then turn off some hopefully Chaos Imps aren't too far away since Rakdos makes creatures very, very cheap. Let's see, he populates his bird, okay. Fair enough. Yes. If that's the only block, I'm happy to give up the uh, Shambler for Rakdos. Seems like a fair trade. Yep, that's cool. 
Rectals it is. Lord of Riots. Good luck with him. Yeah, so arrest will be very, very sad thing to happen to us. <clears throat> the mighty director was arrested. Oh, something else. It's big. What is it? Ooh. Three threes, eh? Fair enough. We can do with three threes. No problem. Okay, so that's what we got. Ooh, gosh, white. Excellent. So we can take with the six, six. Make it a 9-9, nine, nine, potentially. But now I think I take with 6-6, six, six, get the Chaos Imp in. Chaos Imps. To... Yeah, that's probably the best play here. Might as well attack with this 3-3, three, three, since it can't block anyways. So on his turn he threatens for 1... So 6... 9... 10... 12. <laughs> so we should be good with what we have. Especially... We don't need to unleash the Chaos Imps, so we can actually leave them back for defense. So yeah, I quite like that. Okay. So let's get in there. <coughs> Let's see what he wants to do. Okay, trade with... Oh, actually, okay, well in this case... Let me actually use Scores of Might. Uh, get rid of his... Let's get rid of like, everything. The way he's got, like, bump up to three extra damage. Get him in. So get rid of his sent to sent towers. That would be a good result. Actually, so, so yeah, so I think the, yeah, so I think the, uh, Imps will have to wait for an additional turn. I'd rather get Rivers to send towers to shut down his support play ability. I think that's the preferred play here. Um, although we can actually reduce, no, it doesn't help at all. Yeah, that has to be it. So yes, yeah, so we can move this to Sent Towers. So we can only put his, uh, his birds. He can't use Drudge Beetle to make one of his guys bigger. So yeah, we're looking pretty good here. So it's got more flyers into the field. That's fine. Yep, you can block with all you want. So it's taking for five. Which we can easily take. Oh, maybe not. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fair enough, what do we get? Shambler. Okay, well, I oh, just contact with Rakdos here. And uh, can we use uh, flying creatures? He does a trample, so this definitely helps us to, uh, to get there. So let's see how he blocks. Okay. Okay, let's think this through. Um, yeah, do six damage, do more than enough damage. Okay, so we can we do two damage now, so we can still play the Chaos Imps. Um, yeah, that's all there's to say really. So he does three damage. We do three to him. Yeah, that's more than enough. 
See if any tricks off his sleeve. I mean, worse come to worse, can still use launch party to. Um... Okay, can't bond on him. Does not help, I'm afraid. We can. So this becomes a. 4 5. So it still doesn't kill me, I still kill him. So, I'm a bit surprised as to what's going on. Okay, uh, well, it does resolve. It's fine. So we still kill both his flyers. Uh, we can't actually cast the chaos him this turn. We can cast him and him. So. Yeah, so if we kill his 1-1 one, one bird, we can cast the Chainwalker and sh Shambler this turn. So let's do that. Yep, that's right. Um, so the question, do we unleash or do we not unleash? I think we should unleash. Wait, does this not say creature spells cost one life for each life to probably lost lost this turn? So we lost one life, so this should just be one, right? Oh, that's better. Yeah. There we go. And this should potentially But he has ooh, and will have to three target creatures from, from battlefield and a creature from your graveyard. So you can exile creatures um as least the graveyard battlefield turn exile card to the owner's hand. Okay. Well, guess what? He will die. Okay, so it's getting all these guys out. Okay. Okay, shouldn't kill it now because then if all kind of unpleasantness. Okay, so use launch party to get our creatures back. Bastards. Yep, we'll kill you. And we sacrifice you. And it will come back to me. Yay. Out oh, to my hands. Oh, balls. Uh, oh well. Let's start rebuilding our force then. Okay, so go one to. So we actually got the Chaos Imps next turn. That will definitely help us. Pretty much sell this score. Yeah, we'll take four. No problem whatsoever. Uh, so, what we can do? Hellsteed or Chaos Imps. Well, both will help us, I suppose, in a way. Um, I think Hellsteed might actually be the safer play, so he, for sure he doesn't kill us next turn. That would be problematic. So... Let's get in there. Yes. Okay, it's... And I can actually start with both of them, get in there for two damage. Yeah, it will definitely help us. Because I'm not going to block with the guild mage anyway, so... Let's get some life back. What's he doing? Oh shit, I forgot about that. Misplay! Yep, that's... That's bad. It's very, very bad. 
Oh well, they got some life back. Um, so next turn, Chaos Imps for the win then. Okay, I suppose so. Uh, four, 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 five, six. We're dead? Wow, he got there in the end. Good game. That's unfortunate. Uh, yeah, there was a massive mills play to attack with the uh, guildmate as well. Should not have done that. Okay, could have won this, but it's been a bit too greedy there. Uh, but yeah, let's get in for the next match. Let's see, I've lost play first. Yes, please. Okay, so. We've got a very good hand. So we've got like a second drop, so all we need now is mountains to get us uh, to keep us going. Uh, a bit annoying to give easy one the match. Oh well, let's see how things go sometimes. Okay, we need our mountain next turn. Otherwise it's not gonna look pretty for us. Yeah, Mountain will definitely get us in the game. Spell of Thark, and also it's like nice things coming up. No Mountain for us. Okay, we are in a bit of trouble here. Yeah, Mountain, Mountain, Mountain. So we need our mountains fast. Oh, that's a good card to have. Wow. Yeah, definitely. Ooh, mountain. Nice, we got there. Okay, so what are we gonna play? Can attack it with his bird with the No, that's that's an awful play. Awful play. Uh, I think a slot of Thark is probably the best option here. Like a 3-3 three, three first strike on the on the board. It definitely help us to get us there. Man, martial law is a pain. So I don't think I've got any proper removal. Yeah, I don't have anything to do with actually enchantments at all, which is annoying and a nuisance for sure. Oh yeah, Smash Law definitely help is helping him. If they have got Correctos imps on the board, then it's not much of a help, but still. So let's see, okay, it's attacking us. That is fine. What was he playing? Nothing, okay. What I want to see, need more mountains, damn it. Right, so let's get the guild mage out. And see, one, two, three left, no, doesn't make any sense. Uh, so yeah, let's attack with the uh, Shredder for two damage. 
What's this? Birdies. Okay. Mm. Should have known this, of course. So, the question is do we save here with the course of point or not? Um, no, I can't heal my child, to be honest. Yeah, so here we are hoping for light to drop. That's a trick question like Guild Mage or Spread Thug. Spread Thug it is. Yeah, so if we do get Mountain, then the Chaos Imps are gonna get on the field and do some serious damage. And then we actually get in for damage, get the uh, Rectal Slow Riots in. And then he can choose between case him so look riders to, uh, to stop. Either way, it's not going to matter much, I think. Let's see. Yeah, so mountain is what we prefer to have. There's the guild mage, okay. Popping on the ready. Oh, it's in the skies again. Okay. Mountain. Oh, mountain. Still we got cores of might. Hmm. Yeah, things are not looking good here at all. So I have to kill the machine. Do some form of damage. Okay. Um, keep mana open for launch party, I feel. That's probably the best way to go. Yeah. Man, we're like in a tough spot here. We need our mountain. Ooh, that's gonna look good. Okay, fair enough. Okay. No blocks, but I will kill a guild mage. I think it's the best option. I keep the 3-3 uh, three, three alive. So it's the next turn. Yeah, it's be it. It's not good play whatsoever, but... I kind of have no choice here. Yeah, so... I so guess center on the field. It's fine. Still no mountains. This is starting to look quite, I wouldn't say desperate, but bad. Definitely very, very bad. Um, yeah, let's get the chain walk around. Yes, watch me tend to be greedy last game because we shoot easy from the block. But that's the way it is, so he's going to go 5. Yeah, go down 2-3 life. I think this is the end. Oh no, wait, he actually attacked this guy. Interesting. So we do have a blocker this turn. And we shall block. So I think keeps in the game for now, I feel. Yeah, so you draw a mountain otherwise. We are dead or dead. 
There we go. Okay. So. Okay, with Chaos I'm Sin. But we're dead anyway, so where are we? 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 8. Boss gets to attain him. Uh, so sad. So sad. Uh, no, but doesn't really make a difference. This is the end. Actually. Yeah, so we should have won the previous uh, previous game against this guy, just being too greedy. He should hold the Carnival Steed back, or cast the um, Chaos Imps. Yeah, it's to get there, but still, two boosters, not too bad. And that's it. Game. So yeah, so, need to not to be greedy and not make that kind of misplace anymore. But, there we go. That's, uh, that's our matches, and I'll see you guys next time.